My son Jalen, when you were born on December 29th, 1907, my chest was full of pride. It was pumped out so far. Through your younger years, you, there were some difficult struggles as all kids go through. From throwing food in your high chair at the kitchen mall just because you like seeing the different colors, this amused you. Not me and your mom so much, though. Maybe this was God giving us a hint that you were going to be an artist of some kind. Preteen years for you were a little awkward because you were like your dad. You were the tallest and biggest of most kids your age. A gentle giant was born. Go and join the violin and fishing at this point in your young life. You blossomed and grew into a well-rounded and well-liked young boy. Your years as a teen were some of the best. Through your wrestling, God taught you that once you lose or get pinned, it doesn't have to feel right. But what does matter is how you get back up and face your next opponent, or as in life, your next possible hurdle or match. I was so proud of you in high school. I'm so proud of you in college. So, son, as your dad, I will always love you. But I may not always love what you do. This is a small list, though. <laughs> Get it? It's small. Okay. I know, humor. As I look back on your young life, I thank God daily for the memories that can never be taken away from me. Your love for God, your passion for family, your ability to make the world a better place because you're in it. Jalen Brendan Taylor Krupa. Oops, I'm sorry I gave out your government name. JC, I prefer to call you son. Remember what I always tell you about the six C's to life. Care, concern, commitment, and communication lead to the fifth C, which is contentment. But now don't forget about the sixth C. The sixth C is for Christ. Because of all those other things, all things are possible through Christ. And always remember, son, God is the artist. We are but clay in his hands. I love you. I'm proud of everything you do. I am always there for you. Let, Lord, let the Lord work with you, lead you, guide you. As your family, we will always be there for you. But keep him first.